Hello everyone, this is Jim Sung from Informatica Support. Today we are going to see the basic git operation in IACS. Check in, check out and pull. And for pull in October release there was new features. We are going to see those features in this video. Agenda. What is check in, check out, pull? The basic git operations in IACS, demo, best practice and summary. Check-in. Check-in an object to add the object to the source co uh, control repository or add the source control repository. For example, you are configuring the organization with the git. You want to update something in the git from uh, IACS. You can use check-in option. And uh, check-in option cannot exist 50 MP. Once you have a uh, checked in, you can't able to edit the task set. So in that particular scenario, you need to make some changes, right? We can use checked out. Basically, it allows us to make changes. Pull. Pull is nothing but taking assets from source control repository to IACS org. And in this coming October release, we have added two more features for an any engineer want to pull the newly for example newly incremental updates for example modified assets in the last commit you can use only pull the modified asset in the commit hash option in the pull or else if you want uh, to get uh, all the asset you can also choose pull all the asset in the commit hash demo let's jump into the demo yeah before going to the actual demo just check whether you have enabled the source control and in the setting level you need to give this a uh, user for the git repository your user basically for the git they have few user for uh, developer few user who control the particular assets every assets the branches main branches so configure with the user you have uh, given in the particular git let's jump into the demo okay let's see what is check-in here click the three dots check in the asset now we have checked in the mapping one let's check in the kit Now we can see the particular folder test on git here. Let's click that. Yes. Now here we have successfully make a check-in and it have been updated on the kit. Okay, let's open the mapping. So I have checked in the mapping. So you can't see the save button you can only see the run button so it means you can't even change the description of the mapping because it have been checked in okay so to make any changes you need to check out I'm basically checking out you will get this symbol when it's checked out let's click it yeah now you can able to make any changes and save the mapping so uh, just uh, jump into the pull example see I'm again checking in this asset new asset try to yeah successfully checked in let's see what happens in the kit level you can see change to is the yeah two new sets are there you can able to see it right okay then it's time to jump into the pool here we can able to see two commit hash right because we have committed two assets right 
for that usually what is git hash means this is the thing which used to make a uh, efficient uh, data communication or data pull or push uh, using data transmission in the uh, git okay pull all asset what pull all asset means okay I'm clicking this pull all asset next it basically give all the asset to be get pulled usually it's suggested to use pull all asset while in initial setup okay so only pull the uh, modified asset uh, just on the particular commit hash this is the commit hash I'm selecting the last commit hash I have used next here we only getting the last uh, modified asset or which is used in the commit hash so basically it will allows you to only pull the asset which are modified okay let's go back I'm clicking this one yeah I'm selecting that particular commit hash and then I'm just using uh, the modified asset and I'm getting the asset which is modified on but that particular commit hash in this way you can able to pull assets so I am pulling it out and uh, you can check the details in control log whether it's uh, completed or not so here you are able to see the pull is successfully done and then you can see right there is git hash for something uh, pull and check in but not for checked out checked out is something but which we are which is like we are creating another branch taking a copy of it and making changes on it which don't change the exact asset until and unless we are checking that particular asset so it's nothing but happening in Informatica to do that this is nothing which making a uh, process or using data from or updating data to the git we are uh, creating git hash to make that uh, particular transaction to be happen summary Please refer to the particular KB which is given in the documentation if you have further questions on the same. We will love to hear your feedbacks on this particular KB video. It can be posted on our uh, Twitter handle Infa Support. It can be also uh, come through the support videos at informatica.com through the email. Thank you.